Welcome to the picturesque town of Maplewood, where the annual harvest festival is in full swing. The sun casts a golden hue over the bustling crowd, and the aroma of cinnamon and nutmeg fills the air. Amidst the vibrant colors and cheerful laughter, a darker cloud of suspicion looms over Lila Baker. Today, the festival is not just about baking. It's about uncovering the truth behind a mysterious disappearance. As the judges sample the first entries, Lila's mind races through the clues she's gathered. A missing page from a recipe book, Clara's frantic demeanor, and a suspicious delivery driver all play in her mind like a well-rehearsed script. With determination, Lila approaches her grandmother, Evelyn, who is arranging pastries nearby. The tension is palpable as Lila prepares to confront Clara, a fellow competitor, about the missing recipe book. The festival's joy masks a deeper danger lurking just beneath the surface, and Lila knows time is running out to solve the mystery. The judges continue to sample the entries, their expressions revealing nothing of their thoughts. Lila stands at the edge of the competition tent, her determination unwavering. She approaches Evelyn, her grandmother, who looks at her with concern. Be careful, Lila. Evelyn warns, her voice tinged with worry. Jealousy can drive people to desperate measures. Lila nods, her resolve firm as she makes her way to Clara, who is meticulously decorating her cake. The tension is thick, the air heavy with unspoken words. Clara, can we talk? Lila asks, her voice steady despite the flutter in her stomach. Clara looks up, her sharp features momentarily softening. What do you want, Lila? She replies, her tone guarded. Lila presses on. I know about the recipe book. You were the last one to see it. Did you take it? Her eyes lock onto Clara's, searching for a flicker of truth. Clara's expression hardens. You think I'd stoop so low? I'm here to win, not to sabotage. The confrontation hangs in the air, the festival's joy a stark contrast to the tension between them. Lila senses the tension crackle between them, but she refuses to back down. Then help me, she implores, her voice carrying the weight of urgency. Someone is trying to ruin this festival. We need to work together. Clara hesitates, her eyes flickering with uncertainty. The sounds of laughter and clinking glasses fade into the background, leaving only the weight of their confrontation hanging in the air. Lila knows that time is running out, and the festival's joy masks a deeper danger lurking just beneath the surface. Her mind races with possibilities, each more troubling than the last. The stakes are high, and the clock is ticking. As the festival continues around them, Lila and Clara stand at a crossroads, their next move crucial in unraveling the mystery. The atmosphere is charged with suspense, and every second counts in this race against time. Thank you for joining us on this intriguing journey through the Harvest Festival in Maplewood. As Lila Baker navigates the complexities of the baking competition, she finds herself entangled in a web of mystery and suspicion. With each clue she uncovers, the tension mounts and the stakes grow higher. Will Lila and Clara be able to work together to solve the mystery before it's too late? Stay tuned to Storyteller for the next chapter in this captivating tale. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us for more thrilling stories and mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Until next time, keep your detective hats on and your eyes peeled for the next clue.